Een andere film over beroemdheden ging vanochtend in première. Where the Truth Lies van Atom Eglian. Met Kevin Bacon en Colin Firth. De film gaat over twee acteurs die om mysterieuze redenen ruzie met elkaar krijgen. Well, somebody, man, 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 pick this man up, put him on the street, give him something to, give him something to eat, make him a little more neat, introduce him to his mother, make him believe he has a father, send him to England, give him an education, just teach him a little bit about conversation, validation, vindication, oh my God's sake, send this man somewhere where he can have a little bit of self-belief, something, something like the army where he can be sent to exotic places, kill exotic people, give him the very model of a modern major general, teach him about the Persian focus from time for practical, and about binomial theory. The first question from Adam Egoyan luider, waarom hij zijn film, in de jaren 60 en 70 heeft gesitueerd. Ik denk dat dit was een periode waarin ik groeide. Ik denk dat ik had zeker mijn fixaties op bepaalde celebrities had. Ik uh, had uh, een intimacy met ze. En dus de verhaal van een persoon die zijn leven had been touched by een celebrity, die dan had de kans om dat te that was really compelling to me. I've always been drawn by what people do professionally and the whole notion of, you know, deformation professionnelle, where, you know, the job begins to seep into your way of conducting yourself. Well, if you're a celebrity, that becomes even more confused. So all those issues at a psychological level were really fascinating and complex to me. Volgens een Amerikaanse journalist was de film wel erg anti-Amerikaans. The film isn't really trying to condemn... Um, uh, a culture as much as it is trying to show what the uh, hazards are of a lifestyle based on pretending that you're someone else. Uh, what, what, how that wears at you and uh, eats at you and, and, and how corrosive that, that can be. Um, you know, and I think it is uh, a culture that is based on a tremendous sense of the power of the media. I mean, it's, it's you know, it, it's that is true, you know, that it is a, a culture that looks at itself um, all the time. So when, as a character, you're caught up in the middle of that circus, it's bound to have an effect. Um, and that's what I was more interested in showing. Colin Firth and Kevin Bacon spelen niet alleen twee beroemdheden, ze zijn het natuurlijk ook zelf. Hoe kijken ze eigenlijk tegen zo'n persconferentie aan? Press conferences, interviews, um, to me, the idea of that has always been uh, to give the impression that you're being let into the real me and seeing my real soul without really doing that. It's kind of an acting exercise, you know? Listen, gentlemen, gentlemen, please. Gentlemen, if I could just have a moment. Gentlemen, 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 gentlem